Hey guys, David here from TechGeek.com, and in this video I'm going to be talking about the brand new jailbreak for iOS 4.2.1. Stay tuned. So the iPhone dev team just released the brand new jailbreak for iOS 4.2.1, which came out one day ago. Now unfortunately, this jailbreak is a tethered jailbreak for all devices other than the iPhone 3G, the older iPhone 3GS, and the non-MC iPod Touch second generation. If you have any devices other than those three, this will be a tethered jailbreak. Now what's the difference between a tethered and an untethered jailbreak? If it's tethered, you must connect your device to your computer if you want to reboot your device, or if your device runs out of battery. If it's untethered, that means you don't need to connect it to your computer to reboot it. Now, because this current jailbreak is tethered for all devices other than those previously mentioned three, I will not be showing you how to do it. It's extremely simple, however, and it's the same method used as previous methods using Red Snow. I will, however, have a jailbreak tutorial up when the jailbreak becomes untethered. For that, we should hopefully see it sometime soon. So if you're waiting for an untethered jailbreak for devices other than the iPhone 3G, the older iPhone 3GS, and the non-MC iPod Touch second generation, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I can guarantee that I will be one of the first ones to post a jailbreak tutorial when the jailbreak becomes untethered. By subscribing, you'll be notified as soon as I post a new video, that new video being the jailbreak tutorial. Now, if you'd like to jailbreak using the tether method, you can do so by downloading Red Snow 0.9.6 Beta 4 from the link in the video description below this video. You also need to download your IPSW file for the device that you're jailbreaking. I will also have the links for all of those files in the video description below as well. There's really no need for me to show you anything else. All you have to do is follow the instructions given in the program. This works on both Windows and Mac, and so I will have the download links for both of those. So thanks guys for watching, and remember to subscribe to be notified as soon as I post the tutorial for the untethered jailbreak. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.